The President of South Africa, Cyril Ramaphosa, criticized international funders for making it difficult for poorer nations to access aid to fight climate change. Let's take a look. According to a UN-backed report released on Tuesday, developing countries and emerging economies need investments are well beyond two trillion US dollars annually by 2030. Speaking at the COP27 summit on Tuesday, Cyril Ramaphosa asked for a clear roadmap. Ramaphosa said that they need a clear roadmap to deliver on the Glasgow decision to double adaptation financing by 2025 and their emphasis must be on the health well-being food and water security of the most vulnerable people in the world the president has said that they are already scaling up investment in renewable energy and all on a course to retire a number of aging coal-fired power stations adding that the amount of money that is needed for south africa to embark on this difficult journey is close to 90 trillion u.s dollars also, on Tuesday, security had to escort Egyptian pro-government lawmaker Amal Dawish after he disrupted a press conference led by the sister of jailed British-Egyptian activist currently on hunger strike. The activist, currently serving a five-year sentence, was accused of spreading disinformation after denouncing police brutality on social networks.